Okay, how many decon kits am I sitting on? Doesn't strictly say. Radiation protection. So I gotta figure out how to make the gat of the masks. And yeah, I think we're doing fine without the tutorial. Maybe a bit slower, but I feel better. I was just feeling super stressed out for a bit. Probably the tailor's shop. Okay, I'm gonna just slap that there. We're probably gonna want to sneak in a logistics road in between. Okay, well, it's, it looked like I had plenty of time left. It said one season, but I guess not. Oh, well. I'll get it for the next time. I don't think it really even set me back that much. Would have been nice to get the boost, but we'll live. Ah, oh, okay. So we might want to look into a market. Oh, here we go. Temporary storeroom. To store various resources. Might be worth it. Okay, so you're a tailor shop. We want to make... Well, I guess it doesn't really matter too much. Okay, so how many, how many people do I have? Currently this amount. Do we need less? Yeah, let's... Let's knock down the amount of scrap collection we're doing. And then as soon as some of these kids age up, we might put them on science. Builder. I'm gonna get rid of these. We also have some scrap piles that I'm gonna want to get rid of. Let's see. I don't think I really should have a say due to not being an adult yet, but like adult playgrounds that are just normal playgrounds just scaled up sounds neat. The one problem is, weirdly enough, adults are almost more breakable than kids to some degree, so playgrounds aren't quite as useful. Uh... At least I, I can assume a lot of adults would be like, no, I'd hurt myself. Which is entirely possible. Oh, did I... Oh! Can I... Well, I guess we don't have enough spare people. Let's put it back on the deca decontamination plant. Looks like this is getting filled out anyway. Speaking of, how's it doing? 39. That sounds good. I think the people that are unhappy are mainly just unhappy because this place sucks. We could do something about it, but I think I might leave that alone for a bit. How are we doing on wood? We're not doing great on wood. So let's get another forester here. Yeah, sad to say children lose their rubber quality as they become adults. Yep. Like, I feel a little bit here and there where it's just like, yep, nope, definitely can't can't do the same things that I, I did when I was younger. But for the most part, it doesn't bug me yet. I'm sure, give, it, give me another, like, 10, 20 years and then I'll really be complaining. Let's see. Yeah, the only adult playgrounds you know of are indoors. I guess, I, I guess you could argue that, like, a, uh, a common adult playground would be... I'm just going to put weird stuff around the bulldozer lane. This will just be my weird neighborhood. But a, a lot of adult playgrounds I'd almost say would be like, maybe laser tag, definitely like golf. Which is boring. I don't like golf. Uh... Oh! People died. I think that's it. Oh, 
are doing on supplies? We're doing okay on supplies. But we could do better. Let's go full on Forester, at least for the time being. Yeah, dold, uh, died of old age. So we really gotta, we really gotta get the housing up. Because currently I only have space for part of my population. I guess those two will just have to jam right in, but they'll be, they'll be right at the park. Alternatively, maybe not. Okay, that should be enough houses for everybody. We are going to need more wood. In this case, let's nix the builder and have even more foresters. Because my wood supply is just absolutely atrocious and needs to be buffed up. Yeah, unhappy settlers. I'm working on it. I guess logistics, uh, decorations? I'm not just gonna scrap totem right in the center of town. Let's see. Same with a torch and like a street lamp. Because we've got a couple of people that live here that are sad. And we need to work on that one. Okay, what else can I biff out that we don't immediately need? Oh. You're full. We should stop that. We need more cloth. this is this storage capacity is running low storage capacity is running low in that case let's do one less water carrier at least for a little while okay so I need it I need another builder we gotta we gotta get these done because I do not have sufficient children for my people apparently Let's see, airsoft would be an adult playground thing. I'd say that's young adult. I definitely don't feel as inclined to do airsoft or uh, or paintball nowadays. I think a lot of that just boils down to the fact that... Let's see, oh god. I might actually just lose right out here. Wait, why are a lot of my people not living in these house? Oh no. I got nine people living in the shelter. And most of them are incredibly old. We might have to go into survival state for a little while. Almost no production. Uh. Boy. <laughs> Had I waited a little bit longer, we might have actually just uh, doomed ourselves. Just due to an utter lack of things. Okay, so we now have no settlers. Probably due to deaths. Whew. Make medications like herbs. See, so many of these would be good. But we're just in problem town. Okay. Let's nix down the scrap collector and bring the tailor back. Because I, th I think we're going to need neck scarves. I don't know how many I have. Is there a way to check how much spare, like, protective clothing I have? Oh, radiation protection. I got 21. So let's... Let's actually switch over to radiation suits.
Yeah, we lost our decontaminator. Like I said, I think we're going to need to go into survival mode for a little bit just because a lot of my population is going to die. <laughs> Pretty quickly. Okay. I'm gonna make him real happy so they can start doinking. This is weird. Why is it that every time I play one of these survival games, uh, I am immediately put into panic mode where I have to convince my people to start breeding? Otherwise, I'm in trouble. It, like, this happens all the time. Okay. Well, it's fine. We'll make it work. We have we have replacements rolling in. What we're probably going to need is Yeah, a lot of these houses are actually still totally empty. Where do people live? Why do people Oh, wait, no, just the old people live in there. You know what? Don't know what I can do about that one. Okay, so what I'm thinking is, we build the forum and the campfire right here. Actually, question. Housing. Can I fit cabins here? No, I can't. So in that case, let's cancel this. We're gonna... We're going to want to have at least one neighborhood. Probably. Because I, I think a lot of these bonuses are are very circular. No. Well, let's uh let's get rid of this one at the very least. Okay, so community, campfire, here, and forum here. It's offset a bit, and I know that's going to upset somebody, but you know what? I just... There's only, only so much I can do about this. I hate it. Let's get rid of this. Let's get rid of all of this. There we go. Let's back to community. Campfire there. Forum here. And let's go back to logistics. Okay, so obviously these are going to take an, an amount of resources that we don't necessarily immediately have to make. But the sooner I get them done and the sooner I get them made, the better everything's going to be. For the grid, exactly. And I'll probably just put decorations here. Let's take a look at our attractiveness rating. It's pretty attractive. Sleep with each other more. Holy shit, we're in trouble. <laughs> Ooh. Is what it is. Okay. So we have one builder, one fisher, three foresters, which we need. We don't have the decontaminator. No, that's fine. Uh, do I to check? How many adults do I have? Oh, I said my population was going to drop precipitously. We're just about at that point. All right. In that case, I'm going to turn off the refiner, the tailor, the charcoal burner. We need food. We have water. Oh, we've got a... What is that? Sandstorm. Let's see. Do builders repair? I hope they do. If they don't, I don't, I don't know. Okay.
Yeah, let's just have a bunch of foresters doing their job. At least for a little bit. out one of the foresters. Give me a tailor shop again. This just requires cloth, which I have some amount. The only problem is I do not have scrap tool. Okay, do I have anybody still living here? I do. Here's the thing. I'm pretty sure at least one or two of these houses are totally empty. I'm just going to demolish this. That'll give me some extra wood anyway. Okay, we have more kids. So in that case, let's cancel that. Get rid of a couple of these things. Okay, do I have some more? I do. That's good. So we're going to need more more fishers. What if there's an upper limit? Okay, inventory fish. Ah, decontamination kits. Good to know. Okay. Well, it looks like we've we've come out of the swan dive that was our population problems, at least for a brief moment. So I might be able to make this work. Got spooky for a bit, though. Oh, it counts down, not builds up. Of course it does. Why would it do anything else? Okay. I'm going to build this one prioritize this one, because hopefully we should end up with a fair bit of spare wood from taking apart the cabin. And this way we can get that singular scrap tool that we need. And that'll give us a nice nice big happiness boost, at least for a little while, to offset the fact that we are running out of people. Wow, holy shit! Uh, hi! Thank you, Dan's Gaming, for the raid, and welcome on in! We are, uh, we are playing Enzo and World Apart, which, you know what? I, be I bet he was playing that, or has played that within the last couple days. It absolutely seems like the kind of thing he would play. Or was he playing Evil Genius? Could be either. Anyway, welcome on in. Uh, so, I've made the cri critical mistake of not giving my people houses, and so we're currently coming out of one heck of a swan dive into depopulation. And uh, so I'm doing everything in my power to convince my people to breed. <laughs> uh okay, so we need we need a builder. What are we doing? Uh let's see. No. We need wood, but we need slightly less wood. I think I've got enough, so let's take off the tailor. Let's put somebody on the workshop. We want to make scrap tools. And my water carrier died, so I gotta I gotta fix that. Whew! Whew, this is This is dicey, but we're making it work. this? Why is this in yellow? Huh. I have no idea. And hot dang, thank you Mini Merkle for the 20 gifted subs. Thanks so much. Okay. So do we, we... We should be able to get that tool pretty quick. Assuming this person is here and working. Yes. Okay. So then all we need is the people. Uh, technician. Location, location, location. That's a new one. Have a building with a local attractiveness of at least 100. Oh, hell yeah. All right. Uh, so we got everything that we need. Let's just throw caution to the wind and gather a bunch of water. Because I know we can store enough. We just got to grab it. Unfortunately, my people are asleep. 
puts me in, in a bit of a bad way. What do I need on this one? Actually, it looks like to finish this, I just need to put in a little bit more metal, which I definitely have. Main issue is we don't have any builders because I took them all off. Hopefully, well, we actually have almost as many children as we have adults, so I think we're good. <laughs> and we've got three of them that are just about to become adults, like almost immediately. All right, let's get a builder. Oh, do they just move really slowly at night? Or did I slow it down? I slowed it down. That's what's going on here. Alright, get that water. I need this happiness boost. If I could manage it. Unfortunately, it looks like we are going down, not up, because we're in the middle of a drought. No, oncoming drought. Not here yet. Uh, let's see, water. What else can I do? I guess I'm going to build a well. We should have the supplies for it. Okay. I wasn't all in enough, apparently. So let's... Let's pull off the technician. Another water carrier. Forester, more water carriers. You think with the amount of water carriers... Oh, no, 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 no. Let's turn that off. Let's at least have one person on the well. Uh, let's see. Wonder is that 100k bit badge goldenish. Kind of looks like it. I wish I could actually have some kind of, like, sheen. Uh, You've but said that's my what we were people trying. are hopeless cases. We were once. I took in one and all. Together we are strong. Give us what we need. Then no one will get hurt. Uh, you know... What kind of tribute do they want? I have no idea. Okay. Oh. That metal cost is painful. Because right now I can't afford a raid. That's a good thing. I believe you've understood. Well, that sucks. All right, whatever. We'll make it work. All right, so this, this whole thing got bungled. I don't think we would have made it anyway. So now that we have a ton of spare settlers, let's actually maybe look into doing things correctly. Let's see, foresters, water carriers. Let's see, I do have the well person. I don't know how much I want to go in this dire direction as far as people go, but then again, my population is back way on the rise, which is everything that I needed and more. We need to get some herbs. That's what we need. Let's pause. Resources, herbal hut. Gathers herbs and forest can be used to improve people's health. Let's just build it out here. Because, yeah, definitely, definitely going to want to fix that up sooner than later. Because my people, my people are not getting healthy. Oh, the other question is, I currently have enough space for 16 people. 16 adults, specifically. We'll need to scale that up a little bit. At least the happiness bonuses are good. Oh, you know what? Is this... No? Hmm. What does the caution bar mean? Could be a... Could be a radiation thing. I'm not seeing it. I will want to look into a lot of this stuff, but yeah, why does some of these have caution? It's just these two. Because it's not a capacity thing. 
activate or deactivate production on a house. Huh. All right, uh, let's see. Well, let's go back up to speed and just figure it out. Let me see. It's happy happiness is good. Water, we're solid on at this point, especially with the well in place. Radiation protection is doing okay. Okay, so I, I definitely need... Let's put two people on this. Okay. Work-related accident. Eek. That hurts. Sign builders and check the builder mode in your town center. Oh, balanced diet. Our chief are completing... Okay, diet is very lopsided. They'd be glad if we organized more variety in their meal plan. gonna just leave that for a second. So food rationing, banish children, birth control, water rationing, search for survivors. Let's do, uh, let's do this one. We need people. Bad. Okay. Okay, radio message. There are survivors from another end zone looking for a new home. They'll think about joining us if we can meet their high demands for housing. Protective clothing and rations. Sure. Oh, they want full-on rad suits. We can make them. Building is damaged. Let's set that to repair next. I have... Let's set two builders, a tailor, and a charcoal burner. Oh, there's the sandstorm. That's fun. We're still also very low on wood. Uh, it's, I don't know. We'll be okay. Okay, health is going back up. Thank you, Herbalism Hut. Oh, right. I was going to actually point that so it's slightly better organized. What was that? I have no idea. Oh, condition. I see. So my builders have to finish this up first, which hopefully they do. Okay. We'll just assume that they can do it. Oh, boy, the population is catching up with my ability to supply. Let's, uh, let's fix that. Let's do logistics. I'm just going to extend this here. Bonk this here. Alright. So this will give me a decent framework and a lot of space for potentially more people. Which we should probably dive into immediately, seeing as my, my population is going to go through the roof rather fast. I'll figure out the actual logistics of, of storing these people later. So what is this game? This is Endzone, A World Apart. It is a post-apocalyptic survival... Uh, well, survival? Post-apocalyptic town builder, town management sim. Um settlement sim I know there's kind of semi agreed upon terms but it's one of those genres that people use them kind of interchangeably so I'm not quite used to describing it yet okay so there's confidence is low this is something I want to work on need a pub and okay we need a pub that's something we can work on. Pub. Uh, 
Okay. Hopefully pubs. I did not check. Does need a lot of wood though. There we go. Uh, let's see. How many people do we have just kind of bumming around? Because we need more we need more foresters. How are we doing food wise? The other one is we need rad suits. Let's do builders until this gets finished. Lux luckily, this side task will be done fairly uh, fairly quickly. So did it end to nuclear fallout or zombies? I think it's nuclear fallout, considering radiation. What's up with you? Missing resources. Oh. The reason why nothing's getting repaired is because we have bupkis for wood. <laughs> oh, it just loops back on itself endlessly. Okay, so how are we doing resources-wise? No, we don't need another fisher. Let's get a second gatherer. I mean, they're doing their best. I might have to make another one, maybe. I don't know. That feels weird to me. How much do you have left? 510. Well, we're not burning through it too much. Too fast. Okay, we, we're, we're collecting the wood. It just takes a little while. Okay, building condition. This does not inspire confidence. <laughs> this place is totally busted and the rest are just absolutely donks. Ooh. On the plus side, I got 20 people, so... It's about time for a major disaster to absolutely screw me over, which my general assumption is going to be the sheer and utter lack of repairs that I am currently capable of doing. Okay, we got this? Yes. I've got two settlers, so we'll do hard liquor. What does hard liquor require? Uh... Fruits and veggies. Presumably, I have a whole lot of that. I say presumably because I can't honestly tell. Let's... We might need an orchard. Let's, do a, let's start with a 10 by 10. Okay, so hopefully pairs are enough. Okay. Can you get joints in the bar? You can get joints in the bar. It just says required resources, and it looks like it's fruits. I'm hoping that it's just fruits. Okay. A big issue is just, shit's broken, we need wood to fix it. Ah, but we're starting to gain a positive, we're, we're starting to go up with wood. That's a sign. How's this doing? Still busted as hell. How are you guys doing? Slowly. How are my builders doing? Okay, they they are fixing it finally. <laughs> oh, that's fun to watch. Okay, is it fixed now? Yes, in fact, everything is fixed. So I'm probably gonna leave my my people heavily on foresters just because we need a lot. Okay, needs metal. Pub is a blessing. Oh, did we actually make the hard liquor? We did. All right. So we get more hard liquor, more beer, and 20% overall happiness, I hope. 
still got to work on this one. We need metal. Is this the recycler? Yes. Because I burnt a lot of it. Okay. Next order of business. I would say it's finally time. So we have research station and expedition station. This requires something I don't recognize. Maybe it's just metal? Oh, that's big. Okay, maybe we do need the expedition station. And that's a little too big. Well, I can always just put it right here. That's a big sucker. Because, yeah, I think it's time that we start sending people out on expeditions. Another question, I have no idea how housing is looking right now, but I'm assuming it's starting to actually get kind of dire. And I should probably be preemptive about, about this. Which means we're going to run into a serious wood deficit almost immediately. At least the buildings that I needed fixed got fixed. And that's, that's honestly the most important thing for me to do first. Hey, we're back in the happiness range. Just barely. Stay happy, you yutzes. We gotta work probably on diets. Half the population is still children. These people breed like squirrels. Or rabbits. I don't know. I don't actually know how fast squirrels breed. I'm assuming they also breed pretty quick. I know rabbits are definitely the uh, top tier rodent as far as... This is weird. Ah yes, let's rank let's rank rodents based on their breedability. Like that is, this is a dark place to go down. Okay, so we made the rad suits. Let's switch over to the the masks. Because boy, we actually burnt through those radiation suits like crazy. <laughs> 